Good morning and welcome to uh, this tutorial on how to find the grid reference for where you have found a bird that you wish to submit to the uh, predatory bird monitoring scheme. Okay, so we're going to use a online uh, uh, software called uh, gridreferencefinder.com. It's free to use. Um, so first we're going to search for that on Google. So here we go. Um, so I'll just type in grid reference finder. And it comes up with these tabs here, uh, these links here. So it's the top one here, gridreferencefinder.com. Now this brings up a, a, the, the home page for, for, for that site. And what you have here are uh, is a, a map of the UK. Um, you can uh, zoom into areas where you think where you know you found the bird or alternatively what you can do is you can enter a location on the the left hand side here either a postcode or or a road or a town so um i'm going to type in the uh, road on which the uh uh Bird monitoring scheme is based so that's library avenue lancaster and it should find it. There we go. So that's brought up a, um, uh, a detailed map of, of the Lancaster University campus where we're based and Library Avenue where, where, where I said we were. Uh, and you'll see a blue pin here. Now, if you click on this blue pin, left, that's left click, then it will bring up uh, details of, of the location. So it gives you the address, the postcode, and also uh, grid references, Eastings, Northings, and latitude longitude. And the one that we would like you to uh, include on, on the submission form when you're submitting a bird is the grid reference, six figure grid reference, this one in blue here, SD484573. Now, it might not be found on a road, and, or it might be found in some woodland or something like that. So we'll pretend that we've actually found the bird over here in this woodland here. So what I can do is right click, that's right click, and that puts in another pin. And this time it's a red pin but it still has the same oops sorry still has the same location data yep so you so you can can look that up and use that six figure grid reference there alternatively you could um, uh, look down the bottom here and this gives you the the location data for for each of those pins with the eastings norvins latitude longitude and the grid reference as well so you can use those to to uh uh, cross-reference and check that you've got the right location. Thank you for your attention and we look forward to receiving birds from you. Thank you. Bye now.